What's going on everybody? Today is Monday, June 3rd, 2019 and here I am breaking another rule of mine here. I need to get better at that. I got in on this 5 minute candle stick here on the Sigma I should say. I bought the 173.50 calls for the Qs. I bought them at 225. I bought two of them and uh, we'll see where it goes from here guys again i usually do not trade that first five minute candlestick signal but um i like it let's see if i'm right or wrong you can see here guys i bought two of the 173.50 calls that expire in four days bought them at 225 it was a market order let's see if it holds up guys it's not looking very good for me here and I regret to inform everybody that this is my first initial loss here and this is a big 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 loss here but hey you live and you learn guys you live and you learn let me show you the uh, trade here the terrible terrible trade here bought two at 225 and I sold them at a dollar 87 per my exit strategy and that is that that's all she wrote guys what's up everybody it's giovanni from the options trading channel today is sunday june 9th i understand and i apologize greatly that the trade that you just saw me place the bad trade the losing trade was on monday this past monday almost exactly a week ago I've been so ridiculously busy at my day job. Just a little bit more about that here in a little bit. Um, although I did place that bad trade on Monday, which I broke my rule, my rule of not trading that first five minute candle if I get a signal. And if you ever wonder why I don't like trading that first five minute candle, that is why. Most of the time, most of the time, I don't know what the statistic is, but I have seen it personally where it doesn't keep running from the start of the day. If I do stick to my guns on my rules, I'm going to be in a great position. Although that I made a bad trade on Monday, I did place a good trade on Thursday. And I'll get to my uh, screen here in a little bit to show you that trade. But before I do, I wanted to give you a quick update why I haven't been very active in my channel and um, not really trading first of all i haven't gotten a whole lot of signals uh very many signals and i'm being very picky with my trading but also at my day job the owners of the company that i work for they are retiring uh, they're thinking about retiring anyways and it's it's putting a lot of not necessarily stress but it's making me work more and it's not a bad thing but um again i just you know it's a day job it's my day job it's what provides for me and my son so obviously i have to work but anyways again i apologize greatly for the lack of content for the lack of communication that i haven't been placing a whole lot of trades lately so let me, let's get to my computer screens and let me show you the good trade that i made Looking at my uh, trading account here on Tastyworks and off to the right you can see that I have all my orders for the past seven days. Seven days right there for all symbols and this is a, the bad trade here that I bought at 225 and sold at 187 and then also you're seeing here my other order on Thursday. The one that I bought at $1.53, I bought two of them for the uh, 284 calls that expired in I think four or five days I can't remember from Thursday and I sold the first one at $1.67 and I sold that last one at $1.72 and they actually ended up going a lot higher than that as you can see here you're looking at the five minute chart uh, off to your far right the one minute charts in the middle and the one minute chart on the actual option that I actually traded for that day this is for Thursday you can see the uh, date and time here I'm circling around it and I got a signal on the five minutes chart here and I believe let's look back I bought in at $1.53 at 1237 1237 right here 153 so that's me right there at the bottom of the candle and then I sold the first one at just five minutes afterwards at $1.67 and then gosh 
within that minute, another um, that was in this little jump move here. But you can see they actually ended up going to uh, close to 240. And then they ended up going to over five dollars $5 the uh, very next day. But I still wanted to show you this trade, the signal that I did get on Thursday right there. I don't know what move the markets. There had to been something, news piece, something. Obviously, the markets don't jump like that all on its own. So something happened that day. So again, I just wanted to show you guys uh, an update, a recap of my two trades last week. I apologize greatly. I've just been so busy and I'm just now getting uh, this video out to you on this weekend. So let's look for an, an another awesome trade this week. Again, I'll, I'm going to show you all of my trades regardless win or lose. I'm going to show you all of my trades regardless guys so if you haven't already hit that subscribe button down below i would greatly appreciate it um, like and share my videos comment down below what you thought about my trades i would greatly appreciate it as well see you guys here next time